Hi to everyone. This is Manu. Hope everybody is doing well. So, as you all know, that we are being away from our niche topic, that is about gardens and plants and all the beautiful things. We are more towards traveling and exploring um, the nearby areas. So, but today, coming back to our, you know, um, things coming back to our plants and uh, stuff, I would like to share a fact. Yes, this is a fact. You know what? There is a island called Solomon Island, where the trees which are no more required and the trees that are supposed to be cut and supposed to be used in furniture and for that matter any uh, purpose if they are to be used. In that case, they do not cut the trees by swords or any uh, eggs or something. They just simply start, you know, uh, saying bad things to the tree. They simply start cursing the tree, yelling on the tree, abusing the tree day by day, verbally. They don't use their hands. They don't use any weapon. They just uh, see the power of the words. Words are kind of two-sided swords. Yes, of course, if you motivate someone, their spirit, spirit can be motivated, their spirit can be uplifted. But at the same time, if you underestimate something, if you say bad things to someone, even trees which are kind of don't say anything, they are just kind of... So even trees, not only humans, but also trees get affected by negative energy, negative words. So when they want a tree to fall down, they just simply start yelling at the tree, simply start cursing the tree and within 30 days, 30 days continuously, uh, you know, yelling, whoever passing by the tree, yelling on it, uh, saying bad things to it, cursing it and uh, within the span of 30 days, the tree dies and falls on the ground. So this is the power of words. They can, if they can uplift someone, if they can motivate someone or something, even trees, they can, uh, you know, they have so much power to impact negatively also if the words are, you know, used for negative purpose. So uh, my motive of saying uh, this is because I am very concerned towards trees and towards plants. But my motive of speaking about this topic is that stop uh, yelling at people, stop cursing people and stop, uh, most of the parents yell on their kids, most of the parents say uh, sometimes selfish things to their kids ki tum to nahi kar paoge, tum nahi par paoge, tum achche nahi banoge, tum uh, achche bachche nahi ho, ye jo cheeze hum chote mein bachcho ko bolte hain. अगर ये एक पेड़ तक को एक ट्री को इफेक्ट करते हैं एक प्लांट को इफेक्ट कर रहे हैं तो बिलीव मी दे हैव नेगेटिव इंपैक्ट ऑन योर किड आल्सो ऑन अ पर्सन आल्सो सो ट्राई टू स्पीक गुड वर्ड्स इवन इफ यू आर नॉट लाइकिंग अ थिंग ट्राई टू पास ऑन द मैसेज मैसेज इन अ ट्राई टू पास ऑन द मैसेज इन अ पॉजिटिव वे सो दैट अस पर्सन कैन टेक इट पॉजिटिवली रादर देन नेगेटिवली सो ट्राई टू मोटिवेट ईच एंड एवरी लिविंग बीइंग अराउंड यू Try to uplift the spirit of each and every living being around you, no matter it's an animal or a human being or a you know tree. And bless everyone and stay blessed. Have a good day. Bye.